Hi, I'm George. I'm with BluefishToys.com, and today we're going to test the Blade Runner micro aerial vehicle, and it's called the Blade Runner or their Blade Runner Super Small RC Quadcopter. I guess what we'll to call it a quadcopter. It's got four um, helicopter blades. Really small. I actually think this will be quite interesting to try out. It comes with its own controller, and we'll see what it does. And it's hard to believe it's going to be very stable and I don't know, I, I am forever amazed by the electronics in these little devices, so we'll see how it does, and we'll do our whole review. Okay, here it is. It comes with a pretty standard controller that you see with most RC helicopters or quadricopters. It's got controls for, you know, up, down, forward, backward, left, right. It's got the trim controls for trimming him so that he stays stable in different types of air that you've got him in, whether there's wind or not, or indoors or outdoors. It's got trick buttons. It's got a pro button that, that I believe will speed him up for how fast he goes and his acceleration and everything else. But the most amazing thing is, is here he is. This is how small he is. And there certainly are small, micro aerial vehicles out there, but this guy is pretty darn small. He doesn't just fit in the palm of your hand, he's smaller than the palm of your hand. He's got a set of blue propellers and a set of black propellers, because once he's in the air, trying to figure out, I would imagine, which way he's pointing so you can control him. You can use the, the front area of him as the blue propellers. He's also got LEDs on him. He's got a green LED on either side, and he's got a red LED in front. The reason why they're blinking right now is we haven't turned on the controller and it wants to sync up. Once it syncs up, the lights go on steady. So we're gonna try him indoors. You know what, we'll try him even outdoors and see how he does. I don't know how stable it'll be, but let's face it, the electronics and the RCs today are pretty darn impressive. So we'll do the whole thing. We'll do the video review. We'll do an online review that you can see at uh, bluefishtoys.com and we'll see what he does. You okay? Yeah, I think so. Well, he's very tiny. He flies pretty good. He's very stable, but he wants to um, move forward and backwards a lot. I got to get the trim set up.
The trick button is getting pretty easy to use. Um, you do a lot of uh, trimming to keep him stable. And uh, he certainly does do his tricks pretty good. You push the button right here to set him up and it starts to beep. And the next time you push the control, it'll tell him whether he wants to flip left or right or forward or backwards. And uh, you can do the flip. So this is indoors and I don't have a lot of space in this room. So it's a bit tricky controlling them, but not too bad. Okay, we've done our testing and lots of tests indoors and outdoors. Outdoors, if there's any kind of a breeze, it's not going to go well. But he does fly. And you do spend a fair amount of time trimming them. But once you've got them up and, and got space to deal with them, he flies pretty good. Very stable. The only trimming you've got to worry about is having him got it. You know, if he's going a little bit automatically forward or backwards or left or right, you've got to use the trim controls to settle that down. But as far as stability this way, he is a very stable little RC vehicle. Or sorry, a, a micro aerial, aerial vehicle is what they call them. The Blade Runner Atom MAV, not too expensive. It is a lot of fun to use. And he has taken, he doesn't come with any kind of special cage to protect him or whatever, but uh, we got him doing lots of bangs and bumps and running into things and he held up just fine. Nice and small, it's not going to hurt anybody really badly with he hits them with those little propellers. More fun than I thought it would be, actually. And everybody that saw it, they were surprised. They were surprised at his size. They were surprised how stable he was. And doing the tricks, always, you know, even today when people have seen lots of um, quadrocopters doing tricks and doing flips and so forth, this little guy does them quite well. So we were very happy with that. I'm George, I'm with bluefishtoys.com. If you want to read more about this review and see pictures and some of the other details that we went through and things that we found, tricks and techniques, go ahead and take a look at the review at www.bluefishtoys.com. If you want, you can even sign in and we encourage you to log in and you can leave your own mini review if you've already got one, maybe some of the things you liked or disliked about them. And uh, it's always good to see people go onto the site and leave their information about that. I'm not sure if I got him or not right now. There's too much glare. I can't honestly even tell you if I see him in there or not. It's still hard. <laughs> 